Hi, I'm James, and in this video, I'm taking a look at KB Lake, uh, so Core i3, Core i5, and Core i7, running the Cinebench benchmark. Uh, so these are three identical HP laptops, uh, one running the i3-7100U, the next running the i5-7200U, and the third running the i7-7500U. Uh, like I say, all three systems are configured identically with 8GB of memory in a single DIMM and, and a 1TB hard drive. Uh, same chassis, same thermal performance, everything exactly the same in those regards. Uh, also, same driver versions, same Windows version, exactly the same throughout. And what we can see from the test is we actually have pretty linear scaling um, between the three systems. Um, going through this test it's quite nice because you can see the image being built and you can see just how much quicker the i5 uh, the i5 and i7 come around than the i3 and it works out that you basically have um, the i5 is 20% quicker than the i3 and the i7 is 40% quicker than the i3 and between the i5 and the i7 there's a 17% difference so quite nice linear scaling across that range um, this is because obviously while all three chips are using 15 watts of power um, first of all the i5 gets turbo boost so it can run the um, the CPU calls at higher speeds uh, and then the i7 is just a better quality of silicon so generally silicon that's closer from the center of the die which can yield higher clock speeds at the same power consumption um, so anyway, for those who are interested, that is the CPU difference between the current i3, i5 and i7 KB Lake chips. Um, be sure to check out our current videos uh, for gaming performance on KB Lake and other Intel platforms. And hit subscribe to stay in touch with videos as we post them. We will be trying to get up a 3D graphics comparison of the three chips soon. Thanks for watching.